All right, as you can see, I have Logic Pro pulled up with a couple drum loops imported into the arrangement. We have drum loop one and drum loop two. For now, let's take a look at drum loop one and how we can create some one-shot samples from this loop. Here's playback. Okay, so we have a simple loop with a nice kick and clap to it. Both of those sounds I like. When you find sounds you like, the process becomes easy because it repeats itself. I zoom into that sound and then set up my markers. Now you want to set up your initial marker so it corresponds with the initial attack of that drum sound. And then you want to set up your ending marker so it doesn't cut off any of that sound or come in contact with any other sound further in the loop. In effect, we solo it out. Good. Once that's taken care of, we go to File and Bounce. Bounce it down as a 24-bit wave. Done. So let's repeat this process for the clap. I zoom in. I set my markers up. File. Bounce. And again, this is a way you can go through these loops and kind of pick out the sounds you like and organize them in such a way that it benefits you most. <laughs> 